the shade, oh the shade. So, listen. I'm here at my doctor's office, honey. Minding my own fat ass business. Picking up my ADD murder curses, okay? And um, so I'm standing there and I see this little basket over to the side of the counter and I'm thinking, oh hell yeah, they got dum dum lollipops, y'all. I was about to, I mean, I was about to gazelle over the top of that counter and get me some lollipops. And as I drew closer, I realized that it was just a basket of stickers. So I made the comment uh, to the front desk a professional. I said, ma'am, you do not have sugar in here, do you? And she said, no, we don't have, we actually don't have lollipops here anymore. We do stickers. And I said, well, that's unfortunate. And you know, then I minded my own business. Then, cue about eight to 12 seconds later, pan over. This little scary, this little skinny ass, um, Carrie, uh, white lady is over there and she's like, so, and she's checking in all the way on the other side of the counter. And the lady is completely, the uh, front desk lady is completely uninterested in talking to her. And so out of the blue, she just kind of loud enough for me to hear, but a whisper goes, um, so I just got off of this seven day cleanse. It was a detox and you would not believe how much weight I lost. And I just looked over at her. Y'all, I had to slow, blink, and turn, honey. I had to turn slowly to reset my thoughts because there were so many things like running through my mind. Like, first of all, shut the hell up and get out of here. You don't need to be in my face. You don't need to be in my conversation. And you certainly don't need to be whispering loud enough uh, to try to let the fat person hear about your detox, hoping that, that oh, they're going to be my skinny savior. Let me tell you something, honey. Uh, if I want a um, eating disorder, then I'm just gonna make myself throw up like every in, like anybody else. I'm not gonna deprive myself for seven days to lose weight. Okay, I mean an eating disorder is an eating disorder. You can call it a detox if you want, you skinny bitch. But the truth is, honey, you got an eating disorder. Don't try to turn me into an anorexic, honey. I mean, if you want me to do something, turn me into a bulimic. I'd rather eat and puke than starve myself and call it a detox. I'm running around around fat people talking about, uh, yeah, it got rid of all. And she said, it got rid of all of the sugar in my system. Listen, I don't promote eating disorders in any way, shape, or fashion. But if I was going to have one, that ain't the one I'd have. I mean, she's so... Hungry, she's going around trying to tell everybody how to be miserable like her because you know what? She's mad that I was looking for a piece of candy and she, she knew that I could have it if I found it. But she can't because she's too busy shitting and not eating. Listen, that's all I got to say about that. I cannot even imagine what these poor nurses and administrative professionals and doctors have to deal with with these people. The nerve.